the manuscript in a peer-reviewed journal, so we look forward to that. Uh, currently, we know there are other ongoing randomized control trials testing uh, uh, steroids uh, for COVID-19, and we are assembling and coordinating to uh, aggregate data from those trials um, in a meta-analysis to, to give us a bigger perspective, a wider perspective of the studies um, that are ongoing. And then, at the same time, putting into place the mechanisms in order to uh, update our guidance in a transparent and trustworthy way with global experts representing all regions of the world uh, in, a, in the very near future. So all that's going on in place. And again, just to echo, this is something that should be used in hospital for severe patients, for those that are critically ill but not for mild patients. And we hope in the very near future to have more, um, you know, uh, our recommendations more clear, the practice protocols uh, adjusted accordingly, and um, other tools to assist frontline clinicians and member states uh, to make the appropriate adjustments to their national guidelines. Many thanks. Uh, next question comes from uh, CCTV. We have Shane. Uh, with us, Shane. 